bugs. They're gross, they're everywhere, and they're about to blow your mind. Why? Because their own minds have more power than you could possibly imagine. Sure, they make alien noises, they look like creepy ironclad beasts, and they find ways to break into your house. But they pack enough neurons in their tiny brain cavities to get through their daily lives and then some. So sit back and enjoy these surprising stats as the hub shows you the 10 most intelligent insects in the world. And be sure to swat at the subscribe button. The hub has a swarm of mind-blowing facts and earthbound secrets about the animal kingdom just waiting for you to explore. Ants. Those tiny pests whose hills you might accidentally sit on at a picnic actually have the largest brains of all insects. Unfortunately, that doesn't mean an individual ant can outsmart other small-scale competitors, but it gives them an advantage when working as a team. Like a Google search gone wild, hundreds of lowly scout ants are tasked with spreading out around the surrounding radius of the hill in a grand search for food. Once one of them stumbles across sustenance, the scout rushes back to the hill leaving a trail of pheromones in their wake so other ants can frantically pick up on the scent and parade toward the food source. Although it takes a while for the other ants to find the pheromone scent, the group cooperates by emitting more and more pheromones until the other ants are united in the quest for returning the food to home. Researchers found that although ants are smarter as a collective, the older an ant gets, the better and more experienced it is at locating food. If it can gain hunting and gathering skills in such a short lifespan, there's no telling what kind of people skills they'll pick up in a few million years. Bumblebees For the past several centuries, this fat species of bee was known as humblebees, not because of their modest nature, but because of the loud humming they emitted. When the name changed to bumblebee, it was due to their appearance, short, stubby wings on a fat body. It's an insult, to be sure, but bumblebees get the last laugh. Not only are their nectar-gathering activities essential to pollination, and by extension, our survival, they're considered by many experts to be the smartest insects around. Some of their more interesting and clever characteristics involve their seemingly psychic proclivity towards sensing nearby camouflage dangers, their ability to maintain the hive's internal temperature, and their tendency to gather food far from the nest to keep enemies from following them home. Most surprising is Bumblebee's ability to find the most effective means for pollen gathering. Rather than trial and error, Bumblebees are likely to mentally survey a field of potential pollen sources, aka flowers, and follow a determined path that would avoid any flowers their co-workers have already farmed. It's amazing to think that these bees use similar mental tricks as humans. Next time you see bumblebees in the wild, give them a pat on the back. But uh, be careful, they probably won't like that very much. Termites Closely related to your common cockroach, termites live in hive-like mounds. Unlike anthills, these mounds look more like bug world skyscrapers. In some parts of southern Africa, they tower as high as small trees and are essential to the soil. With termites' natural recycling processes adding necessary nutrients to the surrounding land. In fact, these eating machines are known to devour more greenery than many of the larger land-based savanna mammals. Additionally, like ants, Termites may not be intelligent on an individual level, but as a hive, their complex building skills accomplish amazing wonders. From the outside, their mounds are tall and glorious, but from the inside, these complex tunnels have internal and external architecture working in tandem to capture wind and allow airflow through the hive, cleaning out old air and replacing it with new. Like ants, different termites serve in a variety of roles. Some are providers who suck up nearby water and share with their peers, and others are tasked with inspiring slower cellmates to pick up their working pace, and termites display different building styles, almost as if each one has their own unique form of expression. Each mound is like its own city, populated by a variety of different groups and working cultures. Cockroaches Cockroaches seem like they belong on the bottom blocks of the insect pyramid. These common pests sneak into your cabinets searching for food and roam around the tracks of subway trains. But did you know they are considered to have great cognitive abilities when compared to their fellow animals with antennas? It's even been recently determined that these creatures' learning processes differ depending on the time of day. We know this happens with humans. You yourself could have better study habits in the evening, or maybe you're a morning person. Scientists were able to apply this to cockroaches. During their study, they taught their cockroach subjects to associate the smell of peppermint with sweetened water. Normally, cockroaches prefer vanilla to peppermint, 
but the test subjects associated the memory of peppermint with the reward of water and went against their own instinctive judgment. In fact, they were better at retaining this memory when trained in the evening as opposed to the morning. So not only are cockroaches able to be trained like your common domesticated dog, but they can also be taught more effectively the longer they've been active in any given day. Now, uh, if you'll excuse us, we need to go take our cockroaches out for a walk. Locusts. If you've ever read a religious text, you'd know that locusts aren't necessarily the most respected things out there. Although treated as a meal by some cultures, locust swarms are usually associated with doing the eating themselves, as a pestilence descending upon your harvest and devouring your food source. They come in overwhelming numbers, and they don't leave until they've eaten everything in sight. Unsurprisingly, in a trait similar to cockroaches, but unlike many other insect species, locust minds have the capacity to sense touch and taste. It's been reported that locusts, in their swarms, can even sense patterns through their smell receptors, which give them the ability to pinpoint the most ideal spots for feeding. Combined with their capacity to detect direction of shining sunlight, they work as a group to determine flight patterns, acting as if guided by a compass. While they may seem like a mindless swarm of ever-hungry bugs, they work as a well-coordinated team, remembering where they last fed and sensing where they need to go next. They're not mindless animals when working alone, but like any good team, a swarm of locusts is most effective when they cooperate together. Cicadas. Like a limited edition animated movie released from the Disney vault by popular demand, the cicadas only come out when the environment is best for them. The Brood 2 cicadas famously rise from their deep burrows once every 17 years. And while that's a long time to sustain oneself underground when compared to a human lifespan, to cicadas, it's optimal timing for their survival. Many would argue that this 17-year timing is the result of Darwinian evolution, but whether they came to this point through natural selection or are following a brilliantly predetermined calendar, you've got to agree that modern-day Brood 2 cicadas have impeccable scheduling skills. After comparing cicada hibernation and life cycles to other predator-prey relationships in the animal kingdom, scientists found that cicadas prime-numbered 17-year-long development is perfectly timed to avoid their own primary predators. For instance, statistically speaking, a predator with a five-year life cycle would only catch up with cicadas at their peak once every 85 years. Although their loud late-night mating song can get abrasive, these creatures are the product of careful breeding and perfect timing over many generations. You've got to hand it to whoever in the cicada camp serves as their activities coordinator. Dragonflies. How often has this happened to you? You're so focused on composing the perfectly lettered noun on words with friends, you've lost track of all time and space? We imagine that these long-tailed dragonflies have experienced similar feelings. Although this particular ability had only previously been tracked in apes, scientists have found dragonfly brains contain receptors for selective attention. Those lightning-fast fluttering wings can allow dragonflies to hover like a helicopter over a single spot tune out exterior noises and nearby distractions, and focus on a single spot of personal importance. It's really a groundbreaking find for a non-mammal and could lead to other discoveries about the thought processes of these frequent flyers. This trait gives dragonflies a 97% success rate when zoning in on a single prey amidst an entire swarm. This research is being used not only to enhance our understanding of these whip-fast and cunning predators, but also to adapt our own technologies to match their skills. Drones, for example, are being developed to display the same agile characteristics, and scientists have reportedly been able to hack into an insect's brain and access the receptors controlling its movements. With these technologies, there's no telling where dragonflies' talents can take us. Fruit flies. When growing up, Parents often find any opportunity they can to tell you to think before you speak. As a teenager, we may be inclined to do things that seem dumb or embarrassing in retrospect. Well, fruit flies apparently have the same problem, and researchers believe that these buzzing nuisances might try to think before they act as well. This is an amazing discovery for something that's more swatted at than cared about. But maybe you should consider their thoughtfulness before hitting them with a rolled up newspaper. A gene known as FOXP has been pinpointed as an integral instigator behind fruit flies' thoughts, 
After being trained to avoid one of two smells, fruit flies, involved in a cognition test at Oxford, considered both options before settling on the safer choice. When tested again, the smells of each option were stronger, and the fruit flies were able to make quicker judgments. Though their fox pea content is less complex than what's found in humans, it still impacts their ability to learn new concepts and complicated systems. It would be interesting to see how much information fruit flies could retain if geneticists were able to expand their fox pea content. Metal Mark Moth With the great impressionists, it seems like they're born with talent that can't be taught in a class. Jim Carrey, Dana Carvey, Daryl Hammond, born performers who found a means to make money by mimicking personalities in the news and pop culture. The Metal Mark Moth uses its own similar talents as a means of survival. As the primary prey of hungry spiders in Indochina, the Metal Mark Moth is one of those tough few that decides to face its predators head on. Thanks to some natural advantages, it can even intimidate the attacking spider into running away. Blessed with markings and an agile body, the metal mark can shape itself to look like the very spider that wants to eat it. Even though many arachnids are prone to cannibalism, this moth is able to recreate jerky and jumpy arachnid movements, often scaring smaller spiders away. Sure, its physical appearance is the product of its lucky genetic makeup, but it's the physical performance that's key to ensuring the moth lives to fight another day. When scientists covered up the distinctive markings or inhibited the moss movements, they were easy prey. The moss cunning social display was needed to keep it alive and well. Wasps. Wasps, like certain other bee species, actually have abnormally large visual sensors in their brains. They can see more details than other bugs and it gives them a social and strategic advantage. Although each wasp may look exactly the same to us, the wasp's mind allows it to remember the faces of other wasps even after a period of time spent apart. Scientists at the University of Michigan introduced a new wasp into a tribe of 10 others. These other wasps had been with each other for a week before and when reunited, they were much more docile with their companions. However, they reserved their pent up aggression for a new wasp introduced to the social group. Scientists previously believed insects were incapable of displaying that type of memory due to their small brains. But wasps, like the social group of larger animals, need to remember who's who in order to survive. Wasps establish dominance through force and only the strongest is crowned as the queen bee. If you want to stay alive in this environment, it's best to know who kicked your stinger the week before. Thanks to some amazing and evolved memory skills, wasps can compete amongst themselves in that age-old game of survival of the fittest. Maybe someday insects will evolve to be as clever as us humans. While they stand smaller and less emotionally complex than us, they have the capacity to accomplish amazing feats and evolve into stronger and more efficient beings. For now, we'll just have to be amazed with what they can currently do. Some can fly, others can screech, and many can think. We hope you enjoyed these 10 intelligent insects. When you go outside, be on the lookout for smart bugs. And when you go online, be on the lookout for more exciting videos from The Hub. Thanks for watching.